Kura Kaito, ko Virginia Toku Ingoa, no Fakatu Aho. Um, I'm here at Takahi Fetu for my fourth year in a row, and um, I love it. It's some of the best relationship building, Fanonatanga, PD, you name it, that I get. <laughs> I'm Laura from Ōtatahi, um, I represent Te Waipaunamu for Te Reo Ariari and the reason why I'm here as well as for Te Reo Ariari is it's my chance to be with Te Reo Māori, to hear Te Reo Māori and to find out what's happening across this motu for our education sectors. Kia ora nā, tēnā koutou, John, the reason that I come to Kauhi Fetu is because I believe that it's an annual event that needs to be supported by mainstream branches across the Motu. It's actually an annual event that I recommend to any mainstream branch. As a Pacifica person, I also am very interested in the Māori perspective to see what we can do to Tautoko as well as Pacifica people within the Union. So the Haringa was all about us going to the significant places for us here is Te Atiawa and the places where some of our own wars started in the very early days. Places like Parihaka that mourn our people who lost land, uh, that mourn our people who lost their lives, that mourn our people who were abused in those very early days. Buramu King is the popo of the whare you slept in last night. He was a paramount chief. He was a rangatira. Hence the start of the Taranaki War, over land. The whole basis was to get land. It's actually very humbling to be here. Taranaki have been overwhelming with their manakitanga and the corridor around their history has been very heavy in many ways, very substantial and there's been a lot to take in and to think about in terms of our history. Um, which sets a really powerful context for where we're going, which is really what Te Kahui Whetu is all about in terms of where is Māori education, where is Te Reo Māori, where is Te Ao Māori within the context of New Zealand, looking at where we've come from historically to where are we now and where we might go in the future. to have is our members at the back of us. I know people were stressed out there and waiting for it's, it's part of my professional development and understanding what my needs are for my teaching practice. We take all the learning back into our kura and um, hopefully pass the knowledge on of what we're actually about first within the union and then what we can do to help within our kura. You know, it might be karamu, you might think, oh yeah, our whanau we have kidney problems so I'm going to start using this now. I really enjoy going into the pangaro um, workshop and being able to take strategies from that to make it work for our ECE kindergartens, uh, childcare providers. And on the other side of that also then go to the appraisals workshop just affirming my thinking and learning new strategies. We 
we needed to be able to get a really clear Māori perspective on what the climate change might look like for us and how it might impact on, on Māori. And so today we workshop the whole area, the whole idea around what do, we, what do we need to do to care for and look after Papa Tūnuku? And what are the things that we're going to need to be able to take forward to ensure that the way our tipuna worked and honoured and respected the land is the way that we're going to be able to do it going forward and that we'll teach our, our grandchildren. It's quite an exciting piece of work because we have had a lot of work around the Chaki Papa Tūnuku but not looking at it from the impact of it on Māori educators. we are the most powerful education union and we are, when we stand together strong, this campaign gives it to us, all of us part of this, all of this going forward. If you want a metaphor or an analogy that I was just thinking about a herringa we went to yesterday with the double pars up on the ridge up here which were fired on by the British the cannons down there and that great Māori fighting chief Hapa Rona fighting them off, absolutely defeating them. And we're a bit like we're on that hill ourselves getting fired at. But he won and we, we won. Kia kaha. Ko ngā kā hui whetū, ko i rā ka tiro hea ki te rangi. Ko ngā kā hui whetū ki a tātou ko e rā, nā rātau hoki tēnei hekoi nō roto i te riu roa, te miro Māori. Ngā kaupapa, ngā kaiako Māori. Mo ngā kaupapa kato, nā rātau hoki i para mai te huarahi. Ko e ria fiu te rā, e nā koa ko hoki atu, ki te pūtahitanga rehua i te rātau i rua toki. Ko e nā tāku, E kore, ko te kāhui whetu ki a hau, ko te hoki ngā mahara, ki e rā nā rātou te kaupapa i tino tautoko mai, i a mātou e tima tāng. Hāre tonu nei, ki a tātou e hāre tahe nei i ratu ngā kura, ngā kura kaupapa fiti i tai āwhio ngā wahanga katoa. Ki au, ko matariki, te whānau o tēnā o tēnā rohe, ko a tai i nungin te whakāro ko tahi. Ki a piata mai i o nga kōrero, Hei arahi atu, i ngā whetu ririki, arā, e ai te kōreru e ngā konei, ngā tātara riki, arā, ngā tamariki. Hei aha, ke whakakiki ngene ngā wahanga, e takehia nei e tātou i e nei wā. Hei a matariki ki a hau, e aha, kauhi whetu ki a hau, ko te hui hui ngā mai, o ngā tumanako, ko te hui hui ngā mai, o ngā mātanga, ke hanga mai hei hui arahi, Hei whikoetanga ngātahi, i ratu i tō tātau reo Māori, i runga nō rā, i ngā tikanga, ke ai te kōrero, he huarahi whānui, he huarahi mā te katoa.